Because of Stockton's diversity, and also because of our structural challenges with poverty, COVID-19 has really hit the city and its residents hard. Mayor Michael Tubbs of Stockton, California, is spearheading his city's revival despite the challenges of COVID-19. He's one of America's most dynamic mayors, and he's only 30 years old. HBO just released a documentary about him, but we knew he was a star long before that. In 2018, Mark Levin and HBO spent a year with me in Stockton, and from that came this documentary called Stockton On My Mind. I want people to walk away from watching Stockton on my mind with the understanding that the world we live in today is a reflection of our collective actions or inaction. And that if we want to change it, we have to change it. It's not just going to change. As mayor of Stockton, I've spent a lot of political capital and time on creating models that work for people. And one of the most talked about ones is this idea of a guaranteed income or a universal basic income, where we've been piloting for the past two years $500 a month. And what we found is that this idea behind giving people money sounds scary, but it's actually one that makes economic sense. Not saying that's a panacea for every issue, but knowing that it's a powerful tool, particularly in times of pandemics, when folks need money to buy food, when folks need money to not go to work if they're sick, when folks need money to keep up with rental payments if, if business isn't going as well as usual. I use the term pandemic purposefully because we live in a time of pandemic. COVID-19 is one that's exceptional in its breadth and depth. There's communities with other pandemics because of wildfires. There's communities with earthquakes and tornadoes and hurricanes. So this idea of economic disruption being an anomaly is just not true in terms of the world we live in. Bloomberg Philanthropies in the Mayor School was incredibly helpful because I was 28 years old, or 27, I was just became mayor. In the classes around crisis communication, around effective messaging, around how to lead a community, about how to hold your staff accountable was helpful. And that's just been invaluable.